what's up you guys welcome back to my channel it's your favorite girl Armani Jelena and I'm here with another video for you guys so as you can see from the title this video is an interesting video <laughs> because I get a lot of messages about hey how do I start a business with this amount of money or this amount of money or with no money I get all type of questions so I was like why not just make a video and just send people to this video so this video as you can see is about how to start a business when you're broke don't, and also don't forget on May at 6 o'clock p.m. I will be having a webinar and the name of that webinar is Secure 10k in 30 days so I hope to see all of you there now some of you guys will click on this video thinking you're going to get some get rich quick scheme and I'm just gonna give away all this juice to you guys and things like that granted I'm gonna give you guys some valuable tips and tricks but it takes money to make money that's number one and also it takes blood sweat and tears literally so for those of you who may not be financially stable right now or can't, you know, put tons of money up into <laughs> or can't invest tons of money into your business, I want you guys to know that it does not, it does not take a lot of money to run a business. So I'm going to give you guys a solution, mainly for those of you who are in the beauty industry because a lot of people click on my videos that want to open hair companies and things like that. The first thing is going to be joining a dropship company so if there are any of you who are out there who want to start a dropshipping company and either want to have a lash business or starting a hair company a lore 96 which is my company is out there for you guys i have plans starting at 25 bucks a month where you just invest 25 dollars into your business that's it that's all there's no uh un there's no hidden fees or anything like that it's 25 dollars a month and that's the lowest one and it goes all the way up to 49 dollars a month and then i also have some yearly plans that come with websites instant hair uh brand branding bundle reps hang tags things like that so if you guys are interested in that i'm going to send you to allure 96 it's in the description box and just go ahead and read up on it do some research on it and see if that's if this is something that you want to invest your time into but when you let's say want to start a hair company and you don't have any money let's say you have a hundred bucks a way that you can start a hair company with a hundred bucks is going to be finding a vendor now, finding a vendor is going to be one of the most difficult tasks out there just because there's hundreds of thousands of vendors out there and it's up to you to find the vendor that best fits you know your brand so once you find a vendor the next thing I'm gonna say is getting a website it's up to you which website carrier that you, or is it carrier which website builder that you want to go through there's builders out there that have that have monthly fees starting from ten dollars a month all the way to fifty sixty seventy eighty dollars a month and I'm sure beyond so it's up to you how much exactly you want to spend and which software you want to work with but something that i'm going to put out there is a big cartel account if you don't have tons of money a big cartel account a big cartel account will suit you just well uh i believe it's 12 dollars a month if the fees hasn't increased since i have since i've had one when i had one it was about 10 12 dollars a month and i just purchased my domain which is additional 25 dollars so right now we're at the 35 dollar mark now you guys are probably wondering dang okay that's cool but how am i going to start this company and I need hair on hand. The thing is when you're starting, let's say a hair company or a lash company, you can always start your company and order as you go from your vendors. And how that works is, let's say someone orders three bundles of hair from you and you don't have any hair on hand. You can always, you know, have them pay. They pay for those three bundles of hair and then you take that money and purchase it from your vendor and your vendor sends the product to you you send it to your clients so therefore you're not necessarily missing out on any money nor do you necessarily need the hair on hand now that's a solution that you can use but just be mindful that the shipping time will be a little more extensive so make sure that your clients and your customers know that and that's one of the ways that you can start a hair company or a lash company without having any hair on hand with as little as a hundred dollars or even less than a hundred dollars now when it comes when these solutions that I'm giving you it's not it's the legal the the legal side of things is not in the solutions that I'm giving you so as far as getting everything registered legalized EIN numbers um, LLC's DBA's S corporation things like that that's up for you to get and those will run you a pretty penny depending on which state you live in depending on which city you live in and things like that uh, and the next way that you can go ahead of 
go ahead and open a business when you don't really have money is going to be loans now i'm not a huge loan person for one I, loans put you into debt and if you're already in a financial bind do you necessarily want to open up a loan that's something that you as a business owner needs to think about but that is a solution that can help you especially if you are going to do the right things by paying these banks back and not set yourself up to fail so what i mean is you can always go to your local bank branch depending on which bank branch that you want to bank with and you can go ahead and ask them you know to run your credit to see if you can take out a, a, a line of loan and they'll either give you a yes or a no it's typically in minutes you can usually do it online and let's say they approve you to take out a five thousand dollar loan use that money and invest it into your business order inventory get your logo get a um, business cards flyers things like that utilize the money and use it the right way so so far i've gave you guys three solutions to starting a business with either no money or little to no money now it's up for you up to you guys to actually utilize it it's up to you guys to actually take heed to what i'm saying and actually do it uh the first way was drop shipping the second way was ordering as you go from vendors and then the third way is taking out a loan now no matter what it's going to take some form of money to make money so just be mindful of that but don't think that you need thousands of dollars to start a business yes you know uh to get packaging and things like that 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 is expensive down the road but in the beginning you don't necessarily you don't need all of that stuff do what you can do in the beginning and then work your way up to actually where you want to be so i hope this video was beneficial to you guys i love each and every one of you and i will see you guys in my next video talk to you later bye